All right, guys. Well, we are going to be jumping in to the season finale here. <sighs> it's at loads. There we go. Alright, so, season finale, here we go, let's get it. Pepper. Delicious. Best soda ever made. Man, it sure is taking a minute to load this. Ah, previously on Batman the Telltale series. It's obvious that's why Vicky hates you. Your dad helped bump off her parents. Why would my father have the Vales killed? I never said he killed the Vales. She was born in Arkham. Victoria Arkham. So where are you gonna go? I've got some other business I need to take care of. All right, see you later. you do? I destroyed Lady Arkham's drugs. That's not what he said. But the innocent people were a small price to pay. <coughs> you don't understand, Batman. Without me, Gotham is doomed. Oh, is it? Well, thank God he was finally stopped. Nice work, Batman. My job's not done yet. I still need to find Lady Arkham before it's too late. Oh, we will. Bruce, all of your bat tech is linked to this computer. If you take it offline, it will all be inoperable. If Penguin hacks in, he'll have control of all of it. I have to shut it down. What's Lucius, Lucius doing there? He wasn't there. This is supposed to be at Wayne Enterprises. What the fuck? This game series adapts to choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Yeah, that doesn't make much sense. He, he's supposed to be in a, at the company. Children of Arkham have taken hostages. High-profile Gotham citizens, including Police Commissioner Peter Grogan, who was taken while attempting to intervene. I repeat, the children of Arkham have taken hostages. They have. Carry on, gents. Shut up, Penguin. Boss says it's time to get the bat's attention. This episode's being kind of choppy. Hey now. Drop her. Not happening. That man's sighted, boss. Right on top.
Got him. Commissioner, get to safety. I can't just leave these people. City. Sorry, Commissioner. Commissioner! Commissioner! He's... He's gone. <laughs> and there goes Batman. Piece of crap. Alfred. Oh, thank God. With the comms offline, I've no idea what's happening out there. I always fear the worst. It's okay, I got my flip phone. I need to get back to the Batcave. <laughs> figure out Penguin's next move. Let's do it. I can't let him keep hurting innocent... <gasps> oh no, it's reinforced. Impressive as ever! Life off the grid must be treating you well, huh? What's your point? My point is, you're at the end of your rope. You can't even stop me off as a police commissioner! Without your toys, you're nothing. Just turn yourself over to my men. I don't need toys to deal with the likes of you. You sure about that, Batman? It comes from the look of it. You could use a little help. I just had to open up my Don't eyes so I could see. Me. No, no, come on, just stay put. Oh, oh bloody! Heh. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. If I could just find a way to hack into it, I can get to Penguin. What do you mean? You know where he is. Anything? One of his men used a device that targeted my armor. If Penguin has more devices like that... The Batsuit will be a liability. It's already in bad shape. It couldn't protect me from a knife, let alone Penguin's new arsenal. If Batman can't take the fight to Penguin, maybe Bruce Wayne can. Face Penguin as Bruce. Without your armor, you'll be more vulnerable. Penguin thinks he knows me, but he has no idea what I'm really capable of. He certainly doesn't. That's true. And that may be his undoing. Let's do it. Besides, I won't be going alone. Get Gordon on the line. Give him our files on Oswald Cobblepot. Tell him that we did a little digging after he took my position as CEO. He should know who really killed Commissioner Grogan. And that the killer will be in Cobblepot Park. Tell him that Bruce Wayne will meet him there. Let's do it. Lieutenant, these officers are at risk. Penguin is- Green, get back! Idiots. Much 
Martinez. I saw some kind of transmitter hidden behind the statue. Hey, give us room. Transmitter. Wayne Tech. Controlling the drones. God damn it! Some of my officers are still in there. Right. I'm not gonna let some two-bit thief kill my men! If you no. can destroy the transmitter, Oswald loses control of the drones. But there's no way to get to it. You heard Martinez. Lieutenant, you need a distraction. I can keep him talking while you get into position. How the hell are you gonna do that? I don't think listening to the guy who publicly attacked him is at the top of his priority list. I'm the last person Oswald will expect. I can use that. This isn't a gala, Mr. Wayne. Oh, Just making an up. appearance isn't gonna do jack all. Trust me, Lieutenant. I'm your best shot at getting those officers out alive. This is insane. Damn straight. But I'm all out of options. Yes, you are. Let's do it. I'll go in around the back. If he sees me... He won't. I'll keep him focused on me. You will get your chance. Keep the perimeter tight. Okay. Let's do it. If he suspects anything before those drones are offline, we're both dead. Nope. You're gonna be Commissioner. <coughs> and I'm gonna be Batman forever. Same device that fried the suit. It's a hell of a trap, Oz. Those bullies yeah. aren't coming back. They better not. Oh, oh. They say bad things about my family. I'll smash the dumb faces. Stop us, please. I'll smash all the dumb faces. Get the word out, eh? All the channels. Oh, Oz. The penguins got Episode away. Episode five. Park. Sit in the light. Oswald. Bruce, welcome. Hey, the yeah. pigs are making it hard to bring in the bait for Batman. But now that you're here, I have the perfect lure. Not that I'm upset, but. What does bring you by, hmm? Never known a Wayne to stick his neck out. You have something of mine, and I want it back. But what thing is that, eh? Your company, your tower, your precious reputation. I've taken so very many things from you, Bruce, that I wouldn't know where to start. Still, I'm chuffed you popped by. <laughs> well, so far, only Gotham's finest have bothered to show. They paid for sticking their snouts in where they don't belong. You know, I'm surprised Batman's not already here to save you. He's usually so on top of everything. Maybe I need to cause a few more screams. Maybe he's closer than you think, just waiting for his moment to strike. Oh, we'd know if he was. I've arranged quite the sounding light show for his arrival. And when he arrives, oh ho ho, the lights, the sounds, the blood running into the gutters. Once he's out of the picture, there'll be nothing left in our way. Mine or Lady Arkham's. She's so. got some pretty big ideas for the city, and they're about to kick into gear. Lady Arkham doesn't care about you, Oz. She's just using you. Oh, we've got an understanding, her and I. Oh, yeah. Just because you're going to rob my oldest brew, huh? The 
it wasn't so long ago. You and me met in this very park. Yeah. Me crawling out of the gutter. You looking down from on high. Take a gander at us now, eh? Night and day. You'd hardly recognize us, would you? I always treated you with respect, Oz. Respect? Oh, don't make me laugh. You only learned the word after I tossed you out of your company. Oh, yeah? Is that what you think? Batman! Damn it! <laughs> Where the hell is he? He's easily so bloody trapped. Unless... This wouldn't be some kind of plan, would it? You working with the bat? Did you really come here all alone, Bruce? Why, Oz? Are you scared of Batman? Might be, <laughs> if I weren't so certain of my upper hand, as it were. <laughs> Not that you can't look after yourself. You certainly do know how to beat down an unarmed man. I mean, the drug only reveals your true feelings. Felt like you were working out some issues there, hey Bruce? You pissed me off, Oz. So you got what was coming to you. Oh, I'll tell you what's coming to me. Revenge! And it's about bloody time. Your huh. father locked my mum in Arkham Asylum to steal our fortune. He drove my own dad to suicide! The way he's caused the ruin of my entire bloody family. Enough of this! You try to get me all shaken up? I'm not waiting any longer. Batman be down. Ah, that's a lot of drones. We done, chat, no freak. How did they not see Gordon? I'm releasing these drones. He'll make mud out of you and all the lawmen around this park. All right, fine. It's my fault, Oz. What now? You're right. Everything that happened, everything you've gone through, that blame falls on me, on my whole family. How unlike you to admit your faults. <laughs> Maybe you think that'll save you, eh? Nah. Madman. Well, guess what? It won't. Oh, bloody hell! to answer for. Those bloody pigs! How's this for an answer? <laughs> <laughs> what is that gonna do? <laughs> is that all you've got? Show some dignity and defeat, Oswald. <laughs> Freedom is right. Yeah, that's right. Get that stretch. Fucking strap it down. I gotta admit, you surprised me. You were right about this one. Gotham owes you a debt. The GCPD does too. I won't forget it. Thank you. I'd settle for a beer. Yeah, I think we can make that happen. <laughs> you think this changes anything, do ya? Lady Arkham's gonna have your head <laughs> served up on a platter. Is she now? He Can't has a wait. point. We just took down Lady Arkham's top man. She's not gonna stand for this. No, she isn't. I never thought I'd say this, but... I hope to God that Batman has a better idea where she is than we do. Uh, I don't think I do. Batman! The Telltale Series. Yeah, Batman the Telltale Series. That it at the end. All right, roll the credits. Excuse me. Oh, look at that! Back up online, kinda. <sighs> How go the repairs? Going offline kept Penguin from finding the Batcave, but it also scrambled our system. The Bat computer barely runs, and worse, most of my tech isn't working. It's going to take time to get everything up and running again. 
if it gets running again. It will. It's going to yeah, make tracking time. down Lady Arkham a hell of a lot harder. You've proven that you don't need armor or gadgets to help this city. In the end, Bruce Wayne was the one to stop Penguin. That's right. Jude Emerson Johnson. Yeah, music. Still not a Viking Bruce, metal band. These last few weeks, I worry about the toll they've taken on you. Facing off against Harvey and Oswald in a matter of days. Yeah, that'll be alright, Alfred. Not just the physical toll. Those were men you once trusted. And after finding out what you did about your father, people must seem a great disappointment to you. Always letting you down. Well, not all people. You've never disappointed me, Alfred. But I have. Everything that happened, I could have stopped it if I'd done something all those years ago. Uh, this what if, what this if? is my fault. All of it. I told you I wanted to leave your father's employ. But if only I had the guts to do something instead. Your mother, she wanted that. Wanted to put an end to his crimes. If I'd helped her... If I'd stopped Thomas, none of these horrors would have occurred. Lady Arkham... I don't blame you for what happened, Alfred. You did the best you could in an impossible situation. And it helped to make me the man I am today. I... Talk Thank good, you, Alfred. Bruce. You're all right, man. But our work isn't done. The children of Arkham are still out there, and Lady Arkham. With both Penguin and Mayor Dent off the board, she's the only remaining piece. We need to figure out her next move. The only thing we do know is that she moved on from her plan to poison the city. With Penguin gone and my CEO access restored, I can finally log into Wayne Enterprises and see exactly what Oswald was doing during his time in charge. Probably a lot of if I cross-reference that with all the data we have on Vicky Vale, we might be able to figure out the children of Arkham's next move. Well. Your administrative access to Wayne Enterprises should have been reinstated by now, along with your title of CEO. Oh, Let's see what really? Oswald was doing while he sat in my chair. Yeah. Probably not, not a whole Master lot. Cobblepot's oh, sense of humor hasn't changed much since you were boys. Can we just see what he was doing? Penguin was tapping into surveillance systems across Gotham. Any building using Wayne Tech security could be spied on from the CEO's office. How is yeah. that any different than the back door into the Wayne network that he uncovered? That's not... unless... Hold on. What do we have here? They did more than just look at these schematics. Every building in Gotham with a Wayne Tech security system can be accessed from here and remotely controlled. Oh, if Oswald no. was the brawn, Vicky is the brains. So let's check her file. She may have brawny. left clues about what she was using Oswald's access for. Oswald altered several public records using the Wayne network. Let's read mine. Oswald manipulated my records as well. It would appear your degree was in sociology. And my <laughs> medical records. There are some, well, but colorful diseases. <laughs> Annoying, but not hard to fix. Ah, oh, <laughs> that's better. Well, no surprise here, Oswald wiped away any trace of his criminal records. His background is completely fabricated. <laughs> he was enrolled at Cambridge? Ridiculous. <laughs> Calm down, Alfred. I'm sure the board realizes by now that they were fooled. All mention of her birth name, Victoria Arkham, is completely gone. Wait, 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 wait. What's this? He also erased something from Vicky's research at the Gazette. 
can't tell what was removed from here, but Wayne Tech leaves a trace when it alters data. Oh, One the bad computer can decode. Let's do what it. What is it Miss Vale wanted to hide? I don't know. Let's go back, I guess. Wait, what the hell? Can't look at anything else, can I? No. Well, then why didn't that one go? Oh. Oswald certainly wasn't very frugal with my money. Ah. You have a few yachts to return, it appears. <laughs> also explains how the children of Arkham had a seemingly endless supply of guns. Oswald was using Wayne money to arm them. What a Oswald was, <laughs> was trying to buy an island. What huh. on earth for? Looks like he was using his new legal control of Carmine Falcone's assets and likeness to brand the place. It's some kind of tourist attraction. He was hey, going to call Island. it Falcone Island. Falcone? Why would he call it Falcone Island? Hmm. We need to figure out Lady Arkham's next move. Yeah. Of course. There was nothing else in here. Vicky Vale, mid-30s, reporter for the Gotham Gazette, and not in the public record, her true name, Victoria Arkham. To think she was here, in the manor, she gave nothing away of her true nature then. Nope. The Gazette's records of the articles written by Vicky Vale. This record isn't complete. You're right. There are notable gaps between entries, but yet... It doesn't seem she ever left the Gazette's employ. So what was she doing in that time? This record wouldn't be easy to alter. Seeing what Oswald was up to could give us a fresh perspective. What? I already looked into what Oswald was up to. The children of Arkham. Their symbol dates back much farther than their terrorist activity. They formed to get justice for those wronged at Arkham Asylum. But the message fell on deaf ears. Yeah. Until they found a leader Gotham couldn't ignore. Vicky embraced this identity to follow through on her twisted crusade. Her mask inspires fear. Not unlike Batman. I just need to find her. Yeah. Why is that one still accessible? Now that we know how Oswald manipulated oh, okay. Vicky's records, the back computer should be able to... There. there. No more holes. Uh -huh. She was looking into Arkham patients. Reviewing records, checking submissions, prior histories. She was trying to figure out who was actually sick and who was committed because of Hill, Falcone, and my father. Whatever, man. Vicky was digging deep. Gotham City records, freedom of information requests, post to conspiracy forums. All to find. It's a list. Gotham buildings that use Wayne Tech security systems. It's a list of targets. City Hall, Arkham Asylum, GCPD headquarters, Gotham First National. It's almost every landmark in the city. Wow. We're onto something. Vicky wants to bypass the security at a Gotham landmark. But without a man inside Wayne Enterprises, she can't unlock that door remotely. She'll have to get her hands dirty. And when she does, we'll find her. Bruce, you there? It's urgent. One of the bat prototypes has been stolen. By Lady Arkham? Not quite. I'm patching you the feed now. Bat prototypes. Oh, Selena. She stole from you? After we opened our doors to her? After all that you two... Alfred. Yeah, I know, Bruce, but... Why would she do this? Is she that cold-hearted? She must have her reasons. Well, I'm sure she does. The device she stole. It's a prototype. Obviously, you said it's that. It's an electronic skeleton key. With it... Could bypass any security system made by Wayne Tech. 
That key is far too dangerous in Miss Kyle's hands, especially with Lady Arkham still at large. How convenient. Get the car ready, Alfred. I'm going to get some answers from Selina. Wayne won. Mm. Oh. I wasn't expecting you. Thought I'd make it outside the city limits, at least. You should know by now not to underestimate me. I thought you might be busy with... I don't know, saving the world. I'm flattered I rank so highly. But I know you're not here for me. <clears throat> are you? I don't blame you for wanting it back. <laughs> I'm surprised you had a toy like this. No doubt Batman would use it for the good of Gotham, but the less noble options are so much more... exciting. Uh, yeah. Why should I give it back? So much potential. Just imagine what I'd be able to dig my claws into. A thief of your class doesn't need a device like that. It'd only be a crutch. <laughs> Says the man whose belt is an armory. <laughs> Catch. I know you're just playing into my pride. But you're right. I don't need a crutch. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't pretend you're not impressed. As long cons go, this one was a beauty. Getting into Wayne Tech's lab took a lot more than cracking a safe. I had to get close to people. Your friend Harvey. Poor guy just wanted to fall in love so bad. After that, it didn't take very long to get my introduction to his BFF. <laughs> the great Bruce Wayne. Mm -hmm. Imagine my surprise when the rich playboy turned out to be Batman. Scourge of Gotham. You talk a good game, but... I don't buy it for a second. You're not that shallow. You really think you know me that well? I know that whatever this started as... That's not all it means to you now. The only thing it means is that I'm very good at my job. Uh-huh. Sure. Get out of here. I'm getting out of here while the getting's good. Gotham's a house on fire, and I'm not gonna burn with it. If you were smart, you'd get out of here too. This town hates you. Hates your entire family. Oh, knock it off. Just leave it all behind. Do something more... meaningful. With those skills of yours. You don't need the money, but... Gotham needs me. And I won't abandon the people of this city, no matter how they feel about me. After the way they've treated you, you've got one hell of a thick skin. You're gonna need it. It'll be good to put some distance between us. After all, look at what happened to Harvey. It'd only be a matter of time before I crossed one of your lines. Isn't that right? My copy of the Boy Scout Handbook is out of date. I'm bound to break some rule. Selena, I would never hurt you. Bruce, I... That's really sweet. But it brings us to the root of our problem, doesn't it? You're upset that I'm leaving. What'd you think? That one night of sex meant we were going steady? No. Is that what you really thought? Well, maybe it meant nothing to you, but what happened between us meant something to me. Ah, oh, Bruce. Didn't know you were the sensitive type. Come, just stop the show, Selina. Stop pretending nothing matters. <sighs> Look, Bruce. I'll admit that what you and I had... It wasn't terrible. But you were just another job. Uh -huh. A more... Intriguing job than I was expecting. I'll, I'll wait until you get back. Don't it's still worry. a job. And that job's done. I'm done with you. It's not complicated. I'm not a good person. I'm certainly no hero, and I don't want to be. I'm a thief. 
That's all I am. I told you that from the start. Stop. That's not true. I know there's more to you than that. You're just afraid to admit it. You'd like it if that were true, wouldn't you? Why would you even think that? I've made my feelings pretty clear. Why aren't you listening? You saved my life. You could have left me to die back in that warehouse, but you didn't. Someone who's only out for herself, who's just a thief, wouldn't do that. Oh yeah? Who would? A good person. That's who. A hero. Now go. Mm. After I found out you were Batman, <coughs> I thought nothing else could surprise me. But you just keep on surprising me. Something to remember me by. <laughs> I won't need any help remembering you. Well, it's been fun. Bye, Selena. Bye, Bats. Lucius, I've got the key. Uh, hold on, Alfred's on the line. Hey, Alfred, I- Bruce! Lady Arkham! She's here! I, I tried to keep them out, but- Uh-oh. Alfred? Alfred! Oh, no. Alfred! How'd she break that handle? Lucius, it's Bruce. He's not here. Damn it. I'm going to search for clues. Just tell me how I can help. Get over here as fast as you can. I'm on my way. We're gonna find him, Bruce. I know. Look at the fire. Need to focus. Figure out what happened here. Ugh, I hate what this What happened part. to you, Al? These things. Is that you're just your watch? Scuff marks. More like that fucking chemical scuff explosive. scuff mark. Maybe. What could have caused this? Furniture scattered outwards from a single point. From the explosion thing. Ash everywhere. What did they do to you, Alfred? Something big was thrown against this wall. Like a or body. Someone. How the hell? <laughs> Those work. I don't see a connection here. Nope. Obviously not. How about anything else? Oh, busted face. Face was knocked over in the struggle. Fight left nothing untouched. Is there more to the room? Ah, there's a lot of shit in this room. God damn. This pool cue was used as a weapon. Uh -oh. Swung so hard it broke in half. Huh. Alex Blood old. pattern looks like it came off a high velocity hit. Well, would that be this then? Alfred used the pool cue as a weapon. Broke it across his attacker's head. When that didn't stop him, he used the jagged end to stab him, spraying blood across the pool table. been completely corner. destroyed. Alfred must have barricaded himself in here. But they got in anyway. Mm -hmm. Obviously. 
Alfred grabbed the fireplace poker to fend off an attacker. But it was knocked away. Okay. So what, does the scuff mark go to that then? What? No? Yeah? I guess. Lady Arkham must have used the concussion blast from her staff to try and stop Alfred. So that's I know it. what happened. Yeah. The children of Arkham broke in. Alfred barricaded himself inside the parlor. By closing the door? He had just enough time to grab a pool cue as a weapon before Lady Arkham blasted the doors open. He broke it across one of their heads, then stabbed him to get away. Another assailant tackled Alfred, knocking over the vase. Alfred almost escaped, but then Lady Arkham entered the parlor used her staff's concussion blast, scattering all the furniture in her path, throwing him against the wall by the fireplace. So Alfred grabs the nearest thing to use as a weapon to defend himself. But Lady Arkham deflected Alfred's attack, causing the poker to fly across the room and lodge into the wall. More blood on the mantle. He smashed his face into it. All right. Wait, that picture doesn't belong there. Lady Arkham wanted me to find this. Alfred. The butler did it. Password reckoning. You have no idea. Huh? <coughs> the butler did what? Bruce Wayne, you should be rotting in a padded cell. Now, your butler, the man who raised you like his own son, will suffer in your place. But don't worry, you'll get him back eventually. Peace, my bloody peace. No. Alfred! Oh. oh my god. He's going down. Vicky will pay for this. I'll make sure of that. Look at what she's doing to him! All right. Well, then let's get to work. Yes. Alfred keeps adjusting his glasses. The reflection. He's making sure I see the reflection in his glasses. <laughs> he knows the back computer can use multiple reflection angles to recreate the room that he's in. And I can view the virtual image using my cowl. Good thinking, Alfred. Oh, so you fixed it, huh? Okay, Lucius. Freeze frame on the first signal Alfred gives. Did you fix that? Paint us a picture. Here we go. Maybe he just has multiple, I guess. Professional grade camera. Probably came from the Gazette's office. He's wounded. Must be one of the thugs Alfred fought upstairs. Staircase. Stairs leading up. Cement walls. We're in a basement. Whoa. Alfred's trying to look at things that might give us a clue to where he's being held. Okay, looks like we've seen all there is to see in this frame. Let's move on to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Let's do it. Rogers Plumbing. A service company for the water heater. I can use their records to find home addresses for their clients. We're getting closer. Yeah, but we're not there yet. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. Let's keep looking. Nothing else to see here. <laughs> Moving on. Mason stamp. Only one Masonic lodge in the city. Gotham City Fraternal Order of Stonemasons. So the house was built in 1945 by them. 
That's a big lead. Lady Arkham. Keep searching. Jump to Alfred's next signal. You got it. A basement window. What's that outside? Give me a second. They're by a bus stop. There we go. Okay, I think we have enough to pinpoint a location. Yeah, that yeah, bus stop hope. should give it away. It's a lot of basements. These are all the homes serviced by this water heater company on the days and months listed. Okay, filtering for all homes built on that date. I can get the bus line from this, but no stop number. This will help pinpoint the neighborhood. Bowling alley. <sighs> Damn it. Let's keep looking. You are not going to believe this. What is it? Lady Arkham is back at the Vale House, where she killed her foster parents. Huh. According to its records, it has a basement. We know where Alfred is, but I'm without a working bat suit. Actually. Actually. One of the early prototypes. It has basic cowl functionality, but outside of that, it doesn't protect much more than your identity, I'm afraid. Good Let's call. Do it. Thank you, Lucius. It doesn't have all the bells and whistles, but it should still scare the crap out of criminals. <laughs> wow, that is. It's like all leather now. This ends tonight. Yeah. Let's do it. This ends tonight. Heading into the basement. Be careful. Obviously. Yeah, it's back. Good. You back. Didn't see I'm that. all right. You didn't see the fucking tripwire. Even I saw the tripwire. Oh no! There's no one here. No Alfred. Damn it! There's blood on the walls. I'm going to see what I can find. Uh, Standing by. More investigations. Stupid detective comics. The blood hasn't congealed yet. Means we can't be far behind them. Nope. This is where they had Alfred. Yeah. Obviously. Where they beat him. Don't worry, Batman. We'll kill him. We'll kill them all. Well, I guess not technically. Oh, look at that. It goes right into the wall. There's a boot print in the blood. Lady Arkham's soldiers dragged him. The trail stops at the wall. Actually, yeah, you can see that it, it goes, goes under. under it. Sounds like there's more to this basement than it would appear. Taking a closer look. Uh. Now let's find out where the veils were hiding. There's a small room. And an underground with a hole engine. in the floor. Hole in the floor. That's not a hole in the floor. That's like. Ladder. Anyone down there would be trapped. I'm going you wanna, inside. You don't want to lower the, the rope ladder first. Girl, is this the punishment room? Oh, what is this? This is. Fucking weird. Bruce, what's down there? 
Do you see Alfred? No. no. It's some kind of torture chamber. Shackles, belts, blood. What? Vicky. She was kept down here. Locked away. Who could do that to their child? I'm beginning to understand. What is there to understand? To willfully hurt a child? It's why she killed the Vales. They abused her. I'm not saying what she did was right, but... But... I can't imagine what she went through. The Vales' foster children may not have been the only ones to suffer here. I followed Alfred's blood into this hole. If he had any opportunity at all, he would have left me a clue. There are drawings. Vicky must have drawn them when she was a prisoner. The chalk here is different. Newer. apart from the others. Purple. Mm. The same color as my tack. Can't be a coincidence. Maybe... The highlighted words read To Arkham. That drawing looks like Alfred. That's it, just those two. <laughs> Alfred left me another clue. Well, let's This look at it. is what he wanted me to find. To see. He's modified one of her own Lady Arkham drawings to include himself. And these two words. To Arkham. Then she's going to Arkham, and she's taking Alfred with her. That's the final piece. Arkham. She's been using Wayne Enterprises to get access to the buildings with Wayne Tech security systems. Including Arkham Asylum. She's going to open the doors. Release the inmates. Oh, and she no. took Alfred with her. Call Gordon and the GCPD. Oof. I'm on it. Lady Arkham won't be expecting us. We'll catch her by surprise. Is that a camera? It's probably a camera. Arkham Asylum. Where's John Doe? Where's my boy? My boy John Doe! Everything good? Orderlies are rounded up. That's the last of it, then. Is it? The children of Arkham have taken over. Lieutenant Gordon says the GCPD are on their way. He's leading the team himself. If you can find Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. We can help. Almost ready. Let her know. Copy. On our way. Almost Go ready. Go ahead. I got this. Where's John Doe? I want to see John Doe. Batman. This ends now, Vicky. Tell me where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his people. Answer the question. Where he is doesn't matter. He'll be dead soon. Another corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. No one's dying tonight. You really think you're in control here? <laughs> Your confidence is impressive, but that won't save the butler or the rest of Gotham. A lesson needs to be taught. They won't look the other way. Not again. And when did Gotham look away from you? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. You have no idea what I've done to come this far. Too much to turn back now. I know you've suffered. You were tortured, held captive by the people who were supposed to love you. 
I don't know how you survived. You want to know how I survived? I survived. Because every night, I dreamed of the revenge I'd take on them. God. And this forsaken city. The city is kind of fucked up. Out. the true children of Arkham. These souls kept behind the bars. Open the doors! Arkham! Listen to me! Freedom is yours! The only one standing in your way is Batman. Batman. He's got me in here! Me too. Let me have him. He's the crazy one. Alright, come on. Bring it on. That was pretty easy. RV. Hey, Mr. RV. Security systems offline. Every inmate's loose. The leader of the children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went. <laughs> Batman's pretty quick. Got a haircut, huh? Batman. Take your time, sons. Ah, Victor. <laughs> Joe, chill. Now, oh, Gordon, dang. You are going to die. You think so? There he is. I love Truly you. inspiring. Such a pleasure to see your work in person. <sighs> Jesus. Can I shake his hand? I want to shake his hand. Gordon's here. 
We'll round up the rest of the inmates. You stop Lady Arkham. Be nice to Joe. He was just sitting there watching. <laughs> There's no way out now. There's always another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly, they speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. I can't help those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. My pleasure. Whoa. All right. Down the rabbit hole we go. I think. I wonder if Joe's gonna get out. Whoa. Whoa. <gasps> How'd she go invisible? That's some pretty high tech she's got if she can just disappear like that. Coffins. Vicky! Where are we? <laughs> Vicky! Show yourself! <laughs> Why should I trust you'll keep your word? Because my mask is off now, Batman. I won't lie. You're doing so much for one old man. Those men deserved their day in court, just like everyone else. So they could have gotten off like they did so many times before? No, Batman. They got exactly what they deserved. My justice is final and absolute. Is it now? You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is any better than Swan? He hides behind his status and wealth. He's a coward. Other men to carry. How come you can't see these tripwires and I can see them, Batman? Come on. I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. Is that right? What about you? Do you wear the mask to hide? Or to become who you really are? Are you the man? Or the mask? The mask is a symbol. Some fear it. But for others, it brings hope. When I first saw it, I found it inspiring. And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. Get up, Batman. Oh, I just appeared out of the wall. Whoa, so sweet. 
Whoa. It's kind of creepy. Where? What? What is this place? Are we below a church? Hold on, Alfred. Uh, you, you, you came. You came for me. Uh, after what you said, I knew you'd come. The man, the man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. Did you see where she went? Uh, she just dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Uh, above you. Interesting how you speak to him. So familiar. Alfred. <sighs> Such concern. For someone you've never met before. Release him. Then we'll talk. <laughs> you know, I just don't believe you. I think Alfred may be the only way I can make you talk. It makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only one way to find out. Oh. Batman, don't you... Shut up, old man! You've seen my true self. Your turn. Prove that you can. Take off your mask. Let me see the man you really are. If that's what it will take to save him. No! Must be some kind of trick. Bruce Wayne, he, he'd never be the man Batman is. He only looks out for himself. Oh, but of course. <laughs> now I understand. As Batman, you can prey upon the weak, the defenseless. What? Just like your father did. A true Wayne. <laughs> There's nothing heroic about you. Stop blaming other people for your problems. You aren't the only one that suffered. You really think you can preach to me? You? Of all people? Enough! Down, Bruce. There's nothing supporting that beam Stop anymore. Thinking. It's over. Nothing will keep me from my revenge.
Some of these are quick. Like that A that was there for like two milliseconds. As to last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's reign of terror. <sighs> If the public knew the half of it, it's better that they don't. Uh, this came in the mail. It's unsigned. Selena. With everything that's been going on, I... I haven't gotten a chance to thank you for what you did, sacrificing your identity for my safety. But... Uh, it was a dangerous thing to do. Please like and subscribe, you know, before, you could lose before everything. this ends and you're still The secrecy it. you've worked so hard to maintain, uh, gone. Yeah. So please, please, Without you, none of this would work. Like and subscribe to my you YouTube channel. You are my family. Yeah. Awesome, thanks. <laughs> you don't know how good it is to hear you say that. After everything that's happened. And your ear? At least there's something left of it. <laughs> And Dr. Tompkins assured me it adds character. <laughs> that it does. We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. I didn't take them down alone. I had help. You, Lucius, Gordon, Selina and all those who gave their life fighting for Gotham. To those who helped, and those we lost. The damage done by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen. But experts agree that... Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. 
Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. Well, this could be a first start. For you, and for this city. Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of and honored to call my friend. Thank you, Alfred. No, that was weird. Just in my left ear. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. Perhaps Let's one is with. truly the mask. Batman, Batman will be in attendance. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. Awaiting newly appointed acting police commissioner James Gordon, who will address the city for the first time in the wake of these terrorist attacks perpetrated by Lady Arkham. It's daytime. I, as acting police commissioner, Commissioner Gordon, it doesn't sound right. Batman! Is everything all right? I assume you're not here to give a speech. So, what is it? It's an important day. Your first address to the city as acting commissioner. I wanted you to know that I stand with you. I want Gotham to know that there are those who will fight for them. Oh, I'm glad you feel that way. The city's on edge. Tonight can make all the difference. You're one hell of an addition to this lineup. Gotham's best and brightest have turned out for this. Look, I know you're not a man of many words, but I'd like to say something to Gotham on your behalf. Is there anything you'd like them to know? Maybe about how you'd like to be seen moving forward? Tell them I'll always be watching out for them. I'm sure they'll appreciate hearing that. You know, I always wanted this. To be commissioner someday. To have the chance to shape this. <laughs> I should probably be used to that by now. Yeah, probably. Now in the last few weeks, as much violence and terror as I've seen, I've also seen the citizens of this community band together to fight those threats. One of those citizens is Batman. He wanted me to tell you all that he'll be watching. There. Ensuring the safety of our good citizens. But one hero cannot change Gotham on his own. He needs all of you, too. Let Gotham be a city of heroes. United, strong, and hopeful. Bastard to lock up. Yeah, what the? You can stop screaming now, it's and over. Just minutes ago, Acting Commissioner James Gordon delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. <laughs> Batman made short work of the assassin. 
Oh boy, it's gonna be tough to top that. Yes. I'm so glad he got out. But I'll give it a shot. Hell yeah, I so gotta get that next season. <laughs> Episode 5, City of Light. That was the season finale, guys. Uh, thank y'all for sticking with me through this. Uh, I will be getting The Enemy Within, hopefully, shortly. Um, I don't know what I want to play next. Maybe Life is Strange. Uh, maybe some zombie games. Maybe some kind of horror games. I don't know. If you guys have any ideas, you know, feel free to... Uh, let me know down in the uh, the comment section. Uh, so yeah, as always, uh, please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe.